welcome to the LPS News. I'm your host, Tristan Brown. And I'm Leo Gittleman. Today is Wednesday, May 13th. Today's weather is windy with a high of 70 and a low of 52. For lunch, we shall be having roast salmon, grilled eggplant, quinoa, and cucumber salad. Wow, that sounds delicious. Very good lunch. For advisory, everybody is in their individual advisors, except for some 11th and 12th graders who will have college boot camp. That sounds, that is. sounds intense. It does. Now, next Tuesday, May 19th, from 6 to 7.30 p.m. in the 19th floor art gallery, Fine Arts of Amman Manhattan will feature the beautiful art of all middle school students from the three trimesters of studio art that began in September. All are welcome to come out and support the talented young artists whose marvelous creations will be showcased. There will be refreshments, and as always, admission is free. Wow, sounds like an awesome thing, don't you think? Yes, indeed. Reminder, all students, uh, all student government members, please meet in the Commodore's room on Friday, May 15th from 12.30 to 1.30 p.m. Yes. Um, this year's Career Quest will take place Friday, May 15th from 8.30 to 12.20, and Lamont Upper School will be hosting several people from different career fields to speak to our students about their past and current career. I wonder who they're going to have this year. <laughs> now for a special segment. Hello everyone. I have the honor of sitting down with Ms. Richardson and asking her a couple questions about her daily life. So, first things first, welcome. Thank you. First question is, what got you into teaching history? Well, I actually started um, being interested in history in college when I took a trip um, with one of my good friends to Egypt, and then I became really super interested in ancient Egyptian history, so I started taking courses, I developed it into a major, and that became my passion. Wow, that's very exciting, very great. And I know that uh, you're, a, you're a first year teacher at Oman. I also know that you teach sociology to high schoolers, but what else uh, do you do as far as how you spend your time? Here? Well, I also teach seventh grade history and I'm an assistant track coach for the fifth and sixth graders. And I also run the geography club. Wow, you're really, you're really doing a lot here in your first year. That's awesome. Um, what would you say has been your favorite part about Lamont? I think my favorite part is interacting with my students every day because they always make me laugh. Cool. And last but not least, let's have a fun fact. A fun fact is that two of our upper school teachers here, Mr. Hawthorne and Miss Len, actually taught some of my good friends in high school. Well, that is a very fun fact indeed. So thank you for your time, Ms. Richardson. Thank you. And we hope to be seeing you around here more often. See you soon. I'm sitting here with 6th grade advisor and 12th grade history teacher, Mr. Hawthorne. Mr. Hawthorne, thank you for joining me today. Welcome, nice to see you. Uh, can you name one thing that you respect about Ms. Richardson? Um, something I really respect about Ms. Richardson is her grit and her work ethic. I worked with her last year in a, a very difficult uh, school, and she you know, was remarkable throughout the year, just uh, sticking to what she needed to do and getting things done and not taking things personally, and you know, really shows a lot about her personality. Wow, what a fabulous teacher. Thank you for your time and for the scoop, Mr. Hawthorne. Girl said you hallelujah. Girl said you hallelujah. Girl said you hallelujah. Cause Uptown Funk don't give it to you. Thanks, guys. The SAT word of the day is deprecate, meaning to express disapproval. The comedian is best known for the way he deprecates himself and his family. Wow, that's a wonderful sentence. Mm hmm. So we'll see you here tomorrow with more LMPS News. I'm Leo Gittleman. And I'm Tristan Brown, signing off. Have, Have a, a great, great day, Lamont.